There's one thing you should know about Sonic Unleashed before spending your hard-earned money on it. It's a big piece of garbage. Big piece of garbage. That should probably be enough to warn off anybody who's thinking about playing it, but I guess we should talk a little bit more about it, just in case you like to hear this tortured sound of my voice. Indeed, it's games like this that make reviewers rethink their lives. Now, I have a theory when it comes to Sonic games. Someone at Sega hates the Hedgehog with all his might, and he's going about trying to sabotage the franchise with these awful games. This is the only explanation that makes any sense to me. Pretty much every decision made for this game was the wrong one, and Sonic ends up taking more beating than a pinata because of it. The gameplay in Sonic Unleashed is split up into three equal parts. There are daytime stages, which are actually very good. There are nighttime stages, which are actually complete rubbish. And then there's also the hub city where you do a lot of exploration stuff, and that's boring as can be. Now the daytime stages are actually pretty fun. It's fast platforming that is mostly on rails, and for a brief moment you might actually think to yourself, wow, this is what a current gen Sonic game should be. Of course your hopes will be brutally dashed later on, but never mind that for now. The daytime sections aren't perfect by any means, the jump button can be fatally unresponsive at times, and it's just a lot of trial and error gameplay that can get a little bit repetitive after a while. 